We all know what it is. This is my egg plant. Check out my egg. Oh, hi there. I didn't see you there. What am I doing? Well, I'm just watching the new trailer for the new Fallout game, Fallout 76. Another Fallout game in Fallout 4's engine, and only three years after Fallout 4 came out? That I'm on the ship for. Oh, but what's this tweet from Kotaku writer? Now, a lot of people have thrown their hats onto the table for this issue, but I thought I'd weigh in on it because, one, I'm fucking devoid of video ideas. <laughs> Two, because a lot of people have been making a bunch of dumb fucking statements about this game that we've seen one trailer of and are now basing everything we know about on a rumor. People have taken this comment from simply being, oh, this is going to be a single player Fallout game with some online aspects, to, oh, this is going to be an MMORPG like World of Warcraft. This is going to be a sandbox game like Rust. Oh, this is going to be a battle royale like Fortnite. Shut the fuck up. It's it's I can even understand if you were angry that they didn't follow the release schedule and they haven't released an Elder Scrolls game in seven years. <laughs> but most of this complaining is just from people who don't want to see Fallout evolve or change in any way. Do you really want that? Everyone's complaining a lot about how Skyrim and Fallout 4 have been peddled to us over and over in a bunch of different packages. But then they ask for essentially the same game in the exact same format. Any deviation from that is considered bad. I hope the game is fucking online. Maybe it'll be fun. It's not a mean Fallout series game anyway. This isn't retracting from the release schedule except for fucking Elder Scrolls. <laughs> Come on Bethesda, please. Please, I just want to play. I want to play Fallout Wood so bad. Everyone is acting so entitled, like, we deserve this to be another Fallout game. It's like when Fallout 4 came out. We waited seven years for this to come out, so it has to be this way, otherwise we've been shafted. It's a fucking company making a product, and you're purchasing the product. You're not being shafted. Do you remember when Fallout 3 came out and everyone was complaining about it being an FPS? I mean, I don't remember because I was, like, eight years old. Gosh, yeah. But... You, you, you get the point. I'd see it as this generation's New Vegas. Everyone was comparing this game to New Vegas before it even came out. And what they mean by that is it's a non-series Fallout game with some different elements in it. <laughs> same engine as the main series game. Uh, generally the same assets, but you mesh that all together and you get a new game. But I see this as something even better than that. We're not only getting a really good Fallout game, we're getting... We're not getting a main series Fallout game, but we're not getting something that's just a clone of a main series Fallout game. It's its own thing, and I like that. I also find it interesting that everyone's complaining that it's not like Fallout 4, considering that everyone was also complaining that Fallout 4 was how it was. Uh, some final closing remarks. Um, wait till E3, till we know fucking anything about the game, instead of a trailer that doesn't show any gameplay at all, and one rumor speculative story by a Kotaku writer. Stop it with the stupid hashtags. There's never do anything, and they're just really fucking cringy. And three, um, I'm gonna go ahead and be willing to bet that the people who are bitching about this game are gonna buy it anyway. Just, if you're gonna have Bethesda fuck you up the ass, you might as well do it now. Oh, I can't wait now. There are enemies nearby. It's all the people in the comments who are gonna be really pissed after watching this video. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna go fast travel to somewhere else. Alright, you guys, I'm going in.